Hi, I'm Rug, and welcome to another episode of Thief. Hope you've had a good weekend. Just outside. Preparing to break into this building across there with the window. Um, just over there there is actually a, a guy you just can't see him off to the side of the window near the um, candle and we have a guard patrolling down here we're breaking in and we need to get the um, voice box I'm just going to clear this building I'm hoping that down here there's going to be a way through, and there is. Oh, we've got a dog over there we want to get rid of. Hoping by putting the fire out here, he'll do exactly that. I think our best bet is straight in via here. A few more hours and it's off to the siren's rest. Wish there was a sloop stall nearby. Okay, that's trapped. to sight. I 
think sleep is now the last thing on his mind. He certainly got the point. His pipes are leaking. That's outside, so there's no point in going in there. I think this is the security for that safe downstairs. Or chest even. A fine piece. outside. I already checked that. There's no switch for this light. Thank you. 
find peace. So this is the voice box. Perry should have sold it while he had the chance. Well, I think we can safely say that we've been everywhere. Got all the loot there.
This won't go well for you. Not that smart. Siren's Roost. Or even the Siren's Rest. Turning my skull, Sarah. The stranger you will meet and see will tall and dark and handsome be. <laughs> Uncanny! It already said that one. Then it's twice the truth. You really should join the show, sir. I can imagine it now. The Dark Archer. I'm thinking Carnival Owner disappears. Ah, Mr. Thief, you return victorious. Excellent. You are good. Are you sure I can't tempt you into the carnival? The legend in leather? Mm hmm Good news, Mr. Thief. I know the whereabouts of another of my missing exhibits. That is good news. You don't need me, then. No, 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 Sirah. Do I look like the kind of man who slips into foreign parts in the dead of night? No, I do need you. It's the fabled Octopus. Octopus? Yes, an astonishing act of nature at her most perverse. A normal cat, you may think at first glance, but no. Eight legs, Syrah. Could be two Eight. cats. Can you believe it? No. No, sir. Bring my freak of nature back to me, Mr. Thief. Your pockets await my coin. Yeah, sure. Oh, you, sir, are a true gentleman and a scholar, a veritable champion of show business. The octopus is apparently in some dreary private collection near the gatehouse between Stone Market and Riverside. I love a happy medium. I have something for all your nefarious needs. Always a pleasure. Of course it is, sir. I'll be a penniless joke. Someone, I guess. Too bad. It's my teeth. 
be fine. What's Lady Marion doing wearing Evelyn's sleep bracelets? Don't she know it's cursed? The real question is, did she have it before or after her husband was penned on a dead book? Shh, talk some loud. There's nothing extra things wrong to her. I think it's this way. And this is the perfect time to leave for today. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you for watching. If you did enjoy the video, please leave a like and subscribe and we'll see you next time. Goodbye.